Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today we are in Al Baik Park to celebrate the Independence Day of Pakistan. So have a look. I am going to tell you a brief history about the 14th August. Independence Day, which is called Yom Azadi in Urdu, observed annually on 14th August, is a national holiday in Pakistan. It commemorates the day when Pakistan achieved independence and was declared a sovereign state following the end of the British Raj in 1947. Pakistan came into existence as a result of the Pakistan movement which aimed for the creation of an independent Muslim state in the northwestern region of British India via partition. The movement was led by the All India Muslim League under the leadership of Muhammad Ali Jinnah. In the Islamic calendar, the Day of Independence coincided with the Ramadan 27, the eve of which being Laylatul Qadr is regarded as sacred by Muslims. The main Independence Day ceremony takes place in Islamabad where the national flag is hoisted at the presidential and parliament buildings. It is followed by the national anthem and live televised speeches by leaders, usual celebratory events and festivities for the day include flag raising ceremonies, parades, cultural events and the playing of patriotic songs. A number of award ceremonies are often held on this day and Pakistanis hoist the national flag atop their homes or display it prominently on their vehicles and attire. The Independence Day is one of the six public holidays observed in Pakistan and is celebrated all across the country. To prepare and finalize the plans for Independence Day celebrations, meetings are held in the provincial capitals by local governments which are attended by government officials, diplomats and politicians. Public organizations, educational institutions and government departments organize seminar, sports, competition, and social and cultural activities leading up to the Independence Day. In Karachi, drives are initiated to clean and prepare the mazar e for the celebration. A change of guard takes place at national monuments by the armed forces. The Army Air Forces and Navy feature prominently in Independence Day parades. In the cities around the country, the flag hoisting ceremony is carried out by the Nazim belonging to the respective constituency and in various public and private departments. The ceremony is conducted by a senior officer of the organization. In 2017, the Pakistan International Airlines introduced a special in-flight jam session to entertain passengers traveling on Independence Day, featuring artists singing national songs on board a domestic flight. In Pakistan, as the month of August begins, special stalls, fun fairs, and shops are set up across the country for the sale of national flags, buntings, banner and posters, badges, picture of national heroes, multimedia and other celebratory items. Vehicles, private buildings, homes and streets are decorated with national flags, candles, oil lamps, pennants and buntings. The day begins with special prayer for the integrity, 
solidarity and development of Pakistan in mosques and religious places across the country. Citizens attending Independence Day parades and other events are usually dressed in Pakistan's official colors green and white. Many people meet their friends and relatives, dine over Pakistani food and visit recreational sports to mark the holiday. So guys, here is me with my friends, with Naeem, Aves, and Mujtaba. At the end, I want to say Pakistan will remain free, free from every obstruction only if it remains to be the land of the brave. May Allah bless Pakistan with more prosperity, success, and peace. May the Almighty shower all the blessings upon Pakistan forever. I am sending oceans of love to all Pakistani on the day of independence. Let all of us Pakistanis take an oath on this independence day to make our country the best one in the future world. This wish is to greet respectful salute to all the great men who made our Pakistan independent.